So length of the diagonal is 10 cm. Length the length is 2 cm longer than its width. So so something like this. So we have diagonal of 10 cm and then length 2 cm longer than the width. So we don't know what is the length, so we just give it as 2. So this one is length 2 cm longer than the width. Let the width be x. So length is 2 plus x. Alright. Find the length and the width of the rectangle. So we can see, we can have this one as Pythagoras theorem. So this, if this one is x, this one is also x. So we can see here, x square plus 2 plus x square is equal to 10 square. So x square plus 4, this one is 4 plus 2 times 2 times x is 4x plus x square is equal to 100. So we will bring at one side. So x square plus x square 2x square plus 4x. And if you bring 100 to the left, we will get negative 96 is equal to 0. So we can uh, divide by 2 to make it smaller. x square plus 2x minus 48 is equal to 0. So we can factorize x plus 8. x minus 6 is equal to 0. x is equal to negative 8 and x is equal to 6. So we cannot take negative. So x is 6. So x is equal to 6 and this one is equal to 8. So the length and the width. So length is equal to 8 and width is equal to 6. So b find the measurement of rectangle with a perimeter of 26 cm and area of 40 cm. So we see here we have rectangle. So if this one is x, this one is y. So we can see 2x plus 2y is 26 and area of 40 cm. So x, y is equal to 40 cm. So here we can see 2x plus 2y is equal to 26. This is 1, this is 2. So x plus y is equal to 13. X is equal to 13 minus y. So we can substitute so we can substitute 3 inside 2. So 3, 3 into 2. So we have here, this one is x. So we can substitute x inside here. 13 minus y, y is equal to 40. So 13y minus y square is equal to 40. y square, we bring at one side. Minus 13y is plus 40 is equal to 0. y minus 8 y minus 5 is equal to 0, y is equal to 8, and 5. 5. So we can see if we substitute, so x is equal to 13 minus 8, we will get 5. Or we substitute 5, we will get x. So, measurement is equal to, equal to measurement of x cm times 5 cm.